Yeah, yo, and I'm back. Some brand focus. Focusing. Good night, sleep. Yeah, let's get the good night's sleep. Yeah, we should keep it. God, I had a... <clears throat> Let's go. I'm gonna restart this because. Missed it entirely. Wow. Uh. No. Ready. Damn. I. Oh my god. <clears throat> that that happened. <laughs> yep. Oh, they still have Chase Young. It's Weeki. So here are the Giants ready to start their initial drive of the game. Let's do this. They've been underestimating us, huh? Now they see what we can do. Now they ain't gonna listen to it. They go play action here on first down. That's caught. Allen Robinson. And they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. Just like that, a pickup of 20 on their first play from scrimmage. A big play to start him out. Has him at the 45 already. Now this one complete on the slant route. And this will be good for a pickup of nine to the 46. From the 46, here's second down in the yard. Off the play fake, Brown. Let's go. And this will be caught, it's Isaiah Hodgins. And he's taken down, but not before reaching the 10 yard line. Big yardage after the catch, that one winds up going for 36. They'll run for the first time with Saquon Barkley. And he'll find his way down inside the 10 to the 9-yard line. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. <clears throat> Again, it's Barkley. 
breaks a tackle. Teddy, let's go! And he's going to bowl his way into the end zone for a Giants touchdown. Saquon Barkley hitting double digits with his 10th rushing touchdown on the year. And the Giants get the upper hand as they're on the board first here this afternoon. So the Giants getting the football back here for their second drive. And it's only November, but the playoffs, we know how it works. They'll be here before you know it. If it ended today, they would be the number one seed. And that's a great spot to be in, but I love the phrase. If it He's got a man go. complete. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. That one good for 37 yards. Another good throw there in what has been a strong rookie season to this point, Charles, as he now has surpassed the 3,000-yard mark with that last completion. And just think, he's been forced to learn on the job here in his first year. Normally, veterans talk about, hey, I've got the answers to the test before the game even begins. But this guy's taking the test with every throw, with every game. And so far, he's passing with flying colors. A first down carry for Barkley. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. Davis, the one to get up from his linebacker spot and make that play. After the loss, they'll come up second and 13. Off play action. Brown, they'll roll him out right. This is down the field for Bellinger. Let's go! This is caught inside the 15. A big play there for the Giants. 49 yards. Defensive talk 101. Don't let the quarterback out of the pocket because when that happens, yeah, you may shrink the field with your defense, but it's so easy to lose someone on the backside. And he finds him and picks up a big game. And he'll find his way down inside the 10 of the 9-yard line. Two yards that time, a stark contrast from the big chunk on the previous play. Here's Brown, off the bootleg. He'll buy some time right. That's complete, right around the eight. And he's gonna be brought down just shy of the five at the six. Call it a gain of three on the play. And it brings up third and five now. After one, seven, nothing on EA Sports. Giant football and we're ready to begin the second quarter as they've got it with a third down coming up. They'll need five on this play to move the sticks. Now Brown from the gun. Third down. And he will take it on in for a giant touchdown. I'm him. I'm him. A six-yard touchdown run. And the Giants have taken a two-touchdown lead now. And this is a balancing act for a head coach with a rookie quarterback. You've got to walk up. He had the touchdown run last time they had it. Number six for him on the year as they begin with the first down. Brown throwing on first down. This one goes out wide for Barkley. Down the sideline he goes. And he'll get this down to the 39-yard line. It's a big-time play there for the G-Man. 41 yards. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Throwing there, but this pass is going to wind up incomplete. The Giants at 7-3 and three now on the year. And they've been in a great groove. Winners of 7 of their last 10 now on the year. And I thought that they played pretty well last week. Their execution, their discipline, their resilience all on display in that victory. They get seven out of that, so they're left with a third and three. Brandon, perfect defense in this situation would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. There he is, and they passed him off to each defender. Ended up making a nice play, even though it was complete. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. He'll find Hodgins there complete. <coughs> and he's brought down at the 24 after a gain of four. four yards on the pickup. Second and six. And the commander is 24 yards. From the 24 now, here's the second down and six. Back to throw again. Oh, my God. That's going to be caught. Touchdown, Giants. 
Saquon Barkley. He scored on the ground and through the air. And the Giants take a three touchdown lead. Charles. Their quarterback leading this offense back out into a touchdown pass. Get the drive. Set up the screen to Barkley. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. The Giants going to go ahead and use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with just under 30 seconds to go in the first half. Now, on first and 10, he finds him again, Saquon Barkley. A nice little screen to get six on first down. Now the Giants will use the second of their three timeouts. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. Looking to throw on second down. Brown. Let's go. And that one complete to Hodgins. Yeah, Teddy. Touchdown. Teddy Hodgins. That's the first half is winding down. And the Giants will extend their lead here just before halftime. Yeah, now we take a glance at the back. offense as they work their way back out for their first possession of the second half. Well, this offense, this team, they are rolling right now, Charles. They've scored on three straight possessions. You look at the scoreboard, and they pretty much right now got this thing on cruise control. Yeah, and this is that time of game where you and I have to be prepared, right? Isn't this kind of like that empty the bucket time where you have to go into your blowout material and make sure we have some different things? That's what we're staring at right now, the way this one is going. And he swallowed up right near the line of scrimmage. Two runs in a row, but only two yards to show for it. Facing the prospect of a punt from their own end zone, they need some cushion. Let's see what they can do on third down. That is caught. And he's able to get this one all the way past the 30. A big third down conversion with a gain of 28. And the Giants first down. A handoff, Barkley running left. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. That's over 40 yards of movement with those last two plays. Running lanes were at a premium in the first half, but he's able to find some room there, and he's hoping that that's a precursor of a big second half. Throwing on first down. Brown escaping the pressure right. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. The escapability in evidence there is that one good for 15 and a first. First down, Giants. Barkley inside handoff. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. They'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. <coughs> Brings up second and 11 at the 40-yard line. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. God. And, and that is going to be incomplete as he oh, let him a bit too much. To give you an idea of how accurate he's been throwing the football, we're in the second half. That's just his second incompletion. Well, if he's that locked in, that means everyone's locked in because to me it's like throwing a no-hitter in baseball. All the commanders are going to get there as he's taken down. Jonathan Allen in there to get him, and that is sack number. The New York set to take the field. And this one has gone pretty well to form. They've come in, had little problem thus far, and now they'll try to polish things off in the fourth. They'll start out on the ground. It's Saquon Barkley. And this defense not giving him anything there. Maybe a yard up to the 36. Brandon, I've got to think this offensive line has got some smiles on its faces. And I know it sounds crazy, but they practiced for this back in training camp. They knew they'd be in situations where it'd be extra defenders in the box coming after them, yep. trying to keep them from locking down a game. Right now, they want to show the world they're up to the challenge. A first down there on a pickup of 25. Operating from the gun. 
Brown. Gotcha. And he's going to be taken down. Pressure gets there back at the 39-yard line. Deron Payne able to get in there and drop him behind the line. They'll try the right side here. Barkley. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. And now time will be called here as Washington has an injured player down on the field. Well, now they're going to come out and take a look at this injury. And we'll be back in a moment. Pressure comes and down he goes. Jonathan Allen picks up his second sack of the afternoon. Third and long, you knew that he was going to throw it. He just couldn't find anybody to throw it to. Brown on first down. That's complete. He's got Barkley out of the backfield. Call it a gain of a yard, and that'll bring up second down. All defense is worried that whenever anyone catches the ball and has a head of steam come out of the backfield, it could turn into a big play with missed tackles or he runs through people. But they were right there waiting, and they stopped him for a minimal game. And once again, the commander defense stout against the run game. They drop him for a second straight play. So it's Giants football here as we welcome you back. Third down and 10. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And they move this all the way down to the nine. On third and 10, they go flying past the marker and get nearly 40 yards. And even with the game seemingly in hand, they're continuing to fire away, pressing the ball down the field. Listen, it's worked all day. No reason to go away from it now. They'll try and run for it with Barkley. And they'll get this from the eight to the five. Pick up a three. You know, when this offense gets down here near the end zone, they're going to turn to their bell cow. And this guy's been a touchdown machine all year. Excellent job stopping him there on first down. Another try for Barkley. And he takes it into the end zone for a giant TD. Saquon Barkley with touchdown number three here in this game. And New York ready to go again offensively. All right. Um, so I'm going to add my stats a little bit more. That one looks like he'll throw here. Got a man, it's Darren Waller. And he's gonna be taken down, but there's a penalty flag in the backfield. Is this a hold or did they rough the quarterback? So roughing the passer, and this is a unit, Charles. They hold their breath every time they see their quarterback go down and get hit like that. Yeah, they understand how important these last couple of months are for this team. They can still afford to have anything happen to him if they want to accomplish their goals. They follow up that gigantic gain with the tiniest of pickups, one yard. Brings up second and nine. Second down, here's Barkley again. And he's able to break out of one tackle, but then quickly brought down. Personal foul, face man, defense. Charles, did I just hear that right? They declined the personal foul. Three yards, they just declined them. And I have to think that the official is thinking to himself, did I just hear that correctly, that you declined that one? All I can think of is that someone on the field got confused. Because they had to, because you're going to take the yards on that penalty each and every time. So a victory here for the men in blue, the New York Giants. And it was their defense that really made the statement after the break. They pitched the second half shutout. Yeah, think about the team that just got vanquished. They did score in the second quarter. Do you think they thought at all that that would be their last points of the game? No, I, but what a second half the adjustment. Whatever they did in the locker room, it certainly worked. It certainly did, and you're exactly right. Whether it was an adjustment, whether it was just more focus on what they planned to do going in, whether they just played better, whatever it was, it all came together in the second half, and no points were allowed. That's a great way to close them out. 
so for the Jets, they keep pace in the playoff race as they move to eight and three on the year. And they will head back home next week. Meanwhile, for Washington, their luck may have run out as they fall to four and seven now in the year. And they'll have a quick turnaround as they're back in action Thursday afternoon at around 3.30 Eastern for the traditional Thanksgiving Day game in Dallas. Oh, honey, motherfucking 50. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, that was a player of the week performance. <laughs> yeah, leading the league in passing as a rookie. Did not mean to click schedule. Nineteen of eleven interceptions. God damn. All right. All right. Could have been better. Hey, right, I gotta spread the ball. And I'm gonna end this video here.